Washington. Many of President Trump's advisors say he never would have gotten to the White House without the celebrity candidate precedent set by Sarah Palin. On Wednesday, he returned the favor. The former Alaska governor, who's slashing, populist in pumps political style prefigured Mr. Trump's economic nationalist message, bonded with the president, another former reality TV star, during a Wednesday evening West Wing dinner that ended with, appropriately enough, a flaming dish of baked Alaska. The visit, which was not listed on the president's public schedule, included an Oval Office photo shoot and a pose by Mrs. Palin under Hillary Clinton's official portrait in the basement of the executive residence. Accompanying Mrs. Palin, the 2008 Republican vice presidential candidate, were a pair of gun-loving, stringy-haired rock and roll forward slash rock bad boys minus Ted Nugent, guitar player, hunter and paleoconservative, and Kid Rock, who rode the short-lived country rap rock trend to fame, which included a brief marriage to Pamela Anderson. President Trump's invitation for dinner included bringing a couple of friends, Mrs. Palin wrote on her web page which displays a series of behind-the-scenes snapshots with a grinning Mr. Trump. Asked why I invited Kid Rock and Ted Nugent, I joked, because Jesus was booked, she wrote.